Hello! Today we are going to talk about Palm Sunday, which marks the beginning of Holy Week for Catholics. It is a very important celebration in which we remember the central events of our faith, the Passion, Death, and Resurrection of Jesus. According to tradition, Palm Sunday began to be celebrated in the 4th century, when the faithful from the surroundings of Jerusalem went in procession to the Mount of Olives, holding branches in their hands, recalling Jesus' triumphant entry into Jerusalem riding on a donkey, as described in Matthew 21 1-11. During the celebration, a procession takes place, which can be held through the streets or only at the entrance of the church, to experience the moment of Jesus' triumphant entry. It is important to highlight that, according to the Second Vatican Council, when there is a proclamation of the word or a rite celebrated in assembly, there is an updating of that mystery that happened on that day. Thus, the procession is not just a popular devotion, but a true updating of that exact moment when the Lord enters Jerusalem to give himself entirely for us. The celebration of Palm Sunday also narrates the gospel of the passion and death of Jesus, and in some Christian Catholic traditions, it is called the Passion Sunday of the Lord. This is because, by uniting these two realities, the whole unique action, from Jesus' entry into Jerusalem for the last time until his resurrection, is remembered in a single celebration. Another important aspect that needs to be reflected on is that the same people who acclaim Jesus are the ones who ask for his crucifixion. This shows our lights and shadows and makes us reflect if we have chosen Jesus as our King or if we still continue to crucify Him. But what about the branches? What is their meaning? The symbolism of the olive branches comes from an ancient popular custom. When emperors and kings returned victorious from battles, they were received in this way by the people of the time. In addition, the branches are blessed on Palm Sunday and left in the church. Later, they are burned and become the ashes that will be used in the celebration of Ash Wednesday of the following year, reminding us that we are dust and to dust we shall return. Many faithful also take the branches to their homes and have doubts about what to do when they are dry or deteriorated. The solution is to burn them. Some Catholics also place the branches on the doors of their homes as a visible sign that a Christian family lives there and places themselves under the protection of Jesus Christ. And thus, with the celebration of Palm Sunday, we begin Holy Week, remembering the central events of our faith and preparing ourselves for the celebration of Easter, the resurrection of Jesus, which is the pinnacle of our Christian faith. It is a moment for us to come together in prayer, reflection, and penance, meditating on Jesus' sacrifice of love for us and seeking to renew our faith and commitment to Him. In addition, Holy Week also invites us to look at the people around us, especially those who are in vulnerable situations, and to reach out to them with love and compassion, just as Jesus did with us. May we live this Holy Week intensely, allowing ourselves to be transformed by the love of God and renewing our hope in Christ's victory over sin and death. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any of our content about the Catholic faith. Leave your comments and share with your friends and family. We appreciate your audience and see you in the next video.